So, Sridhar, what is your role with Intel IT? I am part of Intel IT's uh, data center network engineering organization. Within that, I focus on our enterprise data center space uh, and designing solutions for uh, our external hosting and enterprise hosting environment. Okay, great. So you are part of the data center efficiency story at Intel. Can you tell me a little bit about some of the things that uh, we've done for data center efficiency? Where the data center efficiency has added value for us um, is it has uh, helped us uh, derive over $650 um, million dollars of benefit, net benefit uh, to Intel and uh, bulk of that benefit uh, we have derived from uh, deriving efficiencies in terms of uh, uh, leveraging proactive server refresh and uh, le leveraging different techniques um, in terms of managing airflow uh, at the data center level and several other techniques to um, evolve towards both uh, getting efficiencies from the data center infrastructure as well as uh, the different components within uh, the computing infrastructure within it um, while also uh, improving um, uh, giving benefit from a green data center and the environment. So Sridhar, what are some of the things that uh, we should think about in terms of green IT? Uh, is it possible or achievable? Uh, impact to the carbon footprint? What, what are the things that you've seen come out of the Intel data center efficiency story? Um, from uh, the efforts that we have looked at from a data center efficiency perspective, um, there are several little things that you can uh, do, uh, several little uh, tweaks that you can make uh, to the overall uh, facilities and the infrastructure that can help you uh, derive um, uh, or evolve towards a green IT uh, data center. And uh, ultimately, green IT uh, data center makes good business sense because it results in direct cost savings to the business. And from a carbon footprint perspective, what we have noticed is um, that uh, if you look at, uh, if you look from the data that we have gathered, servers tend to contribute uh, around 70% uh, of the carbon footprint of uh, the data center, and data centers contribute around 70% of the footprint for our overall enterprise. And knowing that kind of data, uh, or knowing the sources of the, uh, uh, the carbon footprint, you are able to make uh, changes, uh, derive efficiencies, and impact um, your uh, energy savings. And uh, in that sense, uh, server refresh has actually helped deliver um, significant or 75% of our carbon footprint savings um, uh, from a data center perspective. Great. Thanks very much.